<laughs> Not that we confess on video, sir. Yeah. <laughs> it was really good. So, when the first time you used my baton in law enforcement, you had a guy, a guy find another officer, and I'm walking up behind him, I'm like, I wonder what will happen if I just hit him on the side of the leg. So I just, and I threw a three on him. Wow! And I drilled the side of that guy's leg. He cried for I don't know how long. And he just felt it. He's like, oh! He falls in. He's like, my God. Pictures from the jail. They took pictures over the next few days. That very <laughs> I think it's widened out and widened out, right? So we're going to look at the three and the four from that angle. When we throw one, two, we throw three and four, we're going to drop our body just a bit. We're going to the side of the leg, right? That's where we're going to go to the three. And when you hit, we're talking about the concept of fluid shock wave. Can you help me out, sir? If I hit one and I go bang, and I bounce off, right? I think you'll like type one no point turn. Yeah, I back off. I did that three times on the bike. Yeah, right? So, cool. <laughs> When I go here, I can't bounce off. I gotta stick, right? I gotta stick. When we hit, we have blood trauma. We make impact, right? What does most of the damage is the fluid that rushes away from that impact site. It damages the surrounding tissue. So, talking the physics of the thing, right? If I stick to it, boom, and I have that fluid shockwave go out, I cause a lot more trauma and a lot more damage in that area. And that's what I'm learning when I hit this, right? There are times when I hit quick to go. If I can hit that, and make that hit and sink it, boom, I'll cause a lot more damage right now. That's really what I'm going to go to. So we're going to do this. One will come forward like this, throw punches. I'm going to bang, lower it, hit my three, bang, lower it, hit my four, bang, lower, 